Hello, this is not a scream chick, and the big news today is President Obama says he needs a supermajority because, well, he couldn't get done what he needed to do because of George Bush and the Republicans. And the space shuttle endeavor tours around California. And for now, we're going to bring old Cam on with comments on the headlines of today. Which is why I only play Nazis. I get the talking about actually, you know, here's, a, here's a, you know, oh, Herbie Daddy is out today. Herbie Daddy says there's a good possibility I could play a German officer in the reboot of combat that's being done in Canada, which is a problem. And it's all over for the Republicans. Well, yeah, well, we're actually, right now, we're waiting on George Romney to make his gaffe following up the president's statements today that, uh, that George Bush and the Republicans were responsible for the fact that he didn't accomplish the things that he wanted to accomplish during his first term. Mm -hmm. And that he needs a supermajority. If you give me a supermajority, I'll be able to keep all those campaign promises that George Bush and the Republicans basically kept me from keeping up. Basically, he had a super. Oh, oh, oh Herbie, yeah, Herbie Daddy, which is a very, he's old and he's neutral. Herbie Daddy says that. Oh God, he, he said the president was off camera. He was off teleprompter again, and when he's off teleprompter, he tends to actually get really pissed off at people. And they said you could hear in the background. What was it they said in the background? Ted and the man know he had a supermajority already and <laughs> screwed it up. They oh, Herbie Daddy did say he did say he did spend six trillion dollars though. Mm -hmm. But he wants to. Oh, he wants to get another chance to do it all over again. Oh God, amazing. Oh, but there's one. Oh, Herbie Daddy says I need to say one more thing. As a person that was a no, I did. I was in the military at one time, folks. I did go. I protected, basically the enemy never got to California. Mm -hmm. I protected California really great. But um, the President of the United States is now selling flags, the O flag, the, basically. The O flag? Yeah, he, the, okay. Uh, you don't have to do this when you salute the O flag. What you do is you take, you take the President's name and write it on your hand. And when you salute the flag, you basically hold your hand up so, the, so it can be seen that you are saluting the Obama flag. Mm. Doesn't that seem dangerous to people? Mm. Oh, Herbie Daddy says, uh, that seems like scary to me. Mm. But Herbie Daddy and I have something in common. We're both old. But Herbie Daddy actually loves to sit on my shoulder. <laughs> he, it's Herbie Daddy likes me. <laughs> <laughs> and living leader, 50 resident, deadly U.S. consulate raid. Okay. Um, you know how they do things in Libya? My father, everybody by now knows my father was a reserve motorcycle officer for like decades in Los Angeles. He said, you know when you can't solve a crime what you do? You go out and just round up a whole bunch of people and charge them with it. Mm. That's how they do things in, 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 in countries other than the United States. And then they'll execute them all and say it's all been handled. And Larry Flint offering $1 million for Romney's financial records. Well, they've already, uh, they, uh, okay, Ernst & Young, I think it was, was hacked, and they've got the records already. You know why you don't see the records being used? Why? Because he pays his taxes, folks. Oh. They want him to prove he doesn't pay taxes. I mean, and he pays taxes. I, I got you the greatest thing that the Democrats put out and then basically back. Okay, what is it that most Democrats cannot do? Okay, how do Democrats count to two? Okay, um, and and they uh, they said they said George you know George uh, Mitt Romney and his forty seven percent of the people don't pay income tax pay, pay no federal income taxes. Well, four thousand millionaires don't pay in federal income taxes either. Mm -hmm. Well, they tended to neglect the fact that most of those four thousand that don't pay federal income taxes are old and retired, living off of funds and stuff. You know, cutting coupons, and they also. For 140, basically, yeah, 47 percent amounts to about 147 million, mm -hmm. and 4,000 people mm -hmm. that don't. It doesn't even. It's like I think it was 000. something, point zero 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 two something or other, before you could even get to where there was a lot of zeros before that 4,000 even came up, and they all of a sudden when somebody pointed out, God, you guys can't add and subtract. Mm -hmm. They basically pulled that little advertisement. And only organic farming can help save the world from global warming. Yeah, basically what happens is that basically you eliminate most of the people in the world because 
there's not you can't organically farm enough to feed the people and therefore if you eliminate most of the people the factories are all shut down the automobiles are shut down and you're back into the day of oh uh oh I just heard from Herbie Daddy getting you know, Herbie Daddy said, what isn't said? that exactly what the Muslims want to do is to turn the, turn the world back to the Stone Ages? Oh. Except for Muslim leaders who will basically live in these great big uh, uh, fuel-powered homes. They're going to have their automobiles. Just by, you know, they think there's an awful lot. Of, there's a similar with the Sierra Club and Muslim leadership. They all want to turn oh, back is. to another time. And man convicted in 1957 murder, a seven-year-old girl. Uh, here we go back again. Let's put it this way. My, my Angelique, my better half, was, uh, she actually uh, was a criminologist and my father was a police officer. My, they, my father and her would have got together and told you, we're very dubious about somebody that can, gets convicted of a crime with no real witnesses 57 years later. Mm -hmm. I mean, I can't tell you, okay, you know what, how I know what I was doing 57 years ago? How? I have a picture of me singing with Dean Reed. Mm -hmm. I have a picture of me in movies. Otherwise, I couldn't tell you what the hell I would do it in 1955 or 57. And bomb threats prompt evacuations at three campuses. Yeah, it just continues here because the, the Muslim terrorists now know they can make us run by simply calling in a bomb threat, and they're going to keep calling it in. And uh, we do, we will guarantee you, today, the President of the United States admitted that we had a terrorist attack they slaughtered the poor guys in Libya, but it wasn't. It was a spontaneous terror attack because, as, as our ambassador to you, I'm going to tell you, every Muslim in those countries walks around with AK-47 rifles. They walk around with uh, with missile launchers and grenade launchers in their back pockets. <laughs> and Guatemala eruption turns to tourist draw. Oh yeah, I mean uh, volcanoes erupting all over the world. You know what a volcano? One volcano eruption does. It puts more pollutants into the air than all of the automobiles and all the industry in the history of the world puts in. They do it in one shot. Oh, they do? Yeah. Ooh. And what is Pro President Obama's foreign policy on the Mideast? The, the, even the Democrats are saying, the hell if I know. <laughs> they can't figure out why. I mean, okay, his biggest, his biggest non-defenders are the Democrats because they're running for office, folks, and they still can lose the Senate. You know, they're, okay, the plan is now, um, okay, the Republicans will tell you it's 50 plus one. Obama is looking to get 50 Senate, uh, 50 senators to vote for him and, and, and uh, Biden, which is why they need to keep, okay, I'm guessing if Hillary was the vice president, Hillary might throw Obama out as president. Oh. Yeah, so they don't want her in as a, a, you know, but as Secretary of State, though, if anything happened to Biden, guess who's t who gets on the top of the food chain? Mm, it, <laughs> it becomes a uh, blinder than, than Hillary Clinton. And Dream Act Light, seven in 100 eligible illegal immigrants apply. Yeah, nobody is applying for that thing because they don't want to put their name on a record to where it okay, What happens here, the trick is, That's folks, what if you lose the election, they know where everybody's at. I know. So they're not going to come forth, period. It's just not going to be done. And Google rejects the White House request to pull the film clip. Oh, but don't worry. Uh, they're getting ready in California to go after Google uh, in order to force them to pull it off. Hey, uh oh, Kirby Daddy says, what is one of the largest industries in California? It's the entertainment industry, and they're, they're wanting to censor things that are done in the entertainment industry. Hence, does anybody remember about that, that little thing they wanted us to sign at, at Sundance, which basically would give government total control mm -hmm. of the film and television industries in order to prevent censorship? Mm -hmm. And singer Fiona Apple arrested on drug charge in Texas. Yeah, I don't know where the... Okay, the problem is musicians are always smoking something they shouldn't be smoking. I mean, I knew, uh, I knew that Robert Mitchum got bounced from one movie by a well-known Western actor because he got him smoking on the set, so... Oh, yeah. and Obama has more campaign money to spend than Romney. Which is called BNS. You know, uh, Obama is busted, folks. He is flat out broke. Well, actually, he personally has a lot of money. Well, no, they figure he has four to five. I, I, somebody said last night they think he has four to five hundred million bucks setting aside mm -hmm. for the run. When what happens is when he loses the Senate, he loses the presidency, and um, there's a lot of ways to lose the Senate. You, know? mm -hmm. you can basically, uh, uh, basically, in a, a local election, they can have a recall and throw him out of office, and then it's, it, the balance of power changes. And Apple still draws crowds in Asia with a new iPhone 5. 
and basically the iPhone sucks, folks. They basically, they, they got rid of Google Maps and you know, they don't have Yahoo Maps and their map system doesn't work. Oh, actually I spoke with someone the other day that it was getting ready because they pre-ordered their iPhone 5 and what I didn't realize is that they were give, they give you money back for your old iPhone yeah. so the upgrading only cost them like $99. Yeah, but we don't have it. We got to get an iPhone. We're gonna actually gonna have to get an iPad the next month, which mm -hmm. I don't want to do. We got to. I know. And Amish Bishop found guilty of beard shaving attacks. Uh, yeah. <laughs> no, because that basically that's a physical assault. Because that's how they punish people in the Amish community. It's the same thing as they used to cut the pigtails off of Chinese in order to, uh, to then, teach them a lesson. And it's public humiliation is what yeah. they do, yes. And a Monty bubbleism from the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. Okay, when, when you get old, sometimes you do realize there's a tiredness that you never recover from.